Hey, good morning. This morning, we've got a little bit of a sense of urgency going on as far as time. Uh, they're predicting potential tornadoes and storms and that kind of thing starting at around noon. So we've got a lot of stuff we're trying to get, get ahead of here. I'm starting the cows moving. Then I've got to go take care of the goats. We've got to get some more hay moved over to where the yearlings are. Anyway, so we're trying to get a lot of stuff done here at the last second because of the forecast it may go south or north but they're just giving us a pretty high uh, risk for today so we're trying to get going on that and we're doing it as fast as we can so let's get to work fast Maybe they won't fall off as we leave the gate. <laughs> that didn't work. Did you stack them better this time? I feel much better this time about the stack job. Well, I'm gonna watch you as you leave. We'll see. Okay. Oh, he made it! Yesterday we were getting everything ready for the uh, storms they were predicting. That seems to be the way of life here in Oklahoma, but that's the way of life in Oklahoma. And so we were anxious, I was anxious to get down here this morning and check all the animals and just make sure there wasn't any big issues. We ended up not having any tornadoes. The biggest thing was lightning. At one point they came over the, uh, the news uh, when we had a signal and told us that the, the storm was producing 46 lightning strikes per minute. Think about that. <laughs> I'm down here checking the goats. You can see them in the background here. Everything appears to look okay. You okay, White? Let's get the dogs fed real quick and then we'll get out of here and go get the rest of everything checked. We made it down to the cows. I don't see any buzzards. 
<laughs> That's a good thing. You know, we've lost cattle from lightning before, especially when they bunch up. If you lightning hits in the wrong spot, it may kill several of them. Everything is good over here. Yeah. Good morning. We're fixing to make a move with the goats. So I brought the camera uh, just to kind of get a look at things and let y'all kind of have an update on it. We've got a lot of first time babies. Of course, this is one right here, the white face and her baby's right there on the left. That's the kind of nanny you want right there. That kid's already almost as big as her. <laughs> but we've had about three First time dolings have had their babies in the last couple of days. So it's just interesting how they kind of, there'll be little groups of, especially the dolings, that'll kind of start having kids at the same time. And they're usually about a month or so later. This is, uh, actually we're coming up on two months here. So they're a little later. That's not a big deal. We'll, uh, that just means that we'll wean them a little sooner for them, which is good. Uh, because that gives them a chance to uh, recover a little better. So I'm going to just kind of ease through here and kind of get them up uh, rather than just start calling them because I'd rather them get up and get mothered up and, uh, and then start kind of moving them. I need y'all to get up. Everybody up. Everybody up. Everybody up. Let's get going. She still got her triplets. Old brown doe right there. Here's the sister has got her twins. She's slacking. Come on, time to get up. Come on, everybody up. Get up. Everybody up. There's my cull. <laughs> I'll never lose her again. We put a bell on her so I could be sure and find her when it was time to go to town. See that bag? Horrible. She starved her last set of twins. She is gone as soon as uh, September hits. Everybody up. Everybody up. Everybody up. That's pretty good. Now I'm gonna get over in front of them and start hollering at them a little bit and kind of see how they see how they go. Woo, gotta, 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 gotta.
Billy's appear to be doing okay. Zena's right here with them. Well, it's been a hectic couple of weeks, but I think we finally got it all done. We got the all the cows in, at least as many as I could find. <laughs> got all the bull calves sorted off and shipped. We got the heifers sorted off. Uh, got them branded and tagged with the help of Donnie All In and Shane. And did all that in amongst spring severe weather. Lightning, tornadoes, hail, wind, all that stuff. So it is all done. So we feel great knowing that that part's done and, and we're ready to kind of get back to normal and get back to doing things that we normally do. So if you enjoyed this video, like it and subscribe, but knowing we may not be doing the same thing next time. But thanks for watching.